everybody, Becky from Wake 99 are here. I've got another package today, this time again. It's from Goliath Games and Pressman Toys. And it looks like they sent us a bunch of their new toys and games that are going to be out for this fall. Um, we know we all have a lot of family parties coming up. So these can be perfect for, you know, family game night, Christmas, Hanukkah, whatever you have coming up. I'm apparently really bad at using a knife today. So, hold on one second, let me get into this and we'll see what they sent us this time. I have a feeling I know what it is. Um, they just unveiled a bunch of other games at another um, game convention. So, I'm going to actually put the box down and pull things up so we can actually see what's in here. Um, as always, they sent us a lot of paper and the cats do like that, so no complaints here. Um, these are actually... So we have uh, a visit from Jack. I don't know if you'll see Benny or not. Jack, honey, get down, baby. Get all that paper. It's just for you. The first game is a Triwizard Maze game um, from Harry Potter. And this is from Pressman. And it's for ages 5 and up for 2 to 4 players. And it looks a lot... Um, like, sorry. It get in the game. Uh, sorry, Jack is in the box. So that's nothing new. Um, is it sorry where you push the little thing in the middle and it pops the dice and you move that many? But it looks like that and it looks like you have a bunch of different homes and different teams that you can go to. Um, eventually we'll find Jack somewhere in there too. But you are trying to get your way out of the maze and hopefully you survive and Voldemort's not there for you. So that is the first game. I will put a link for this down below at the bottom. Honey, you are sitting directly on what I need. I'm going to move this. Come on, come on, come on, no teeth. And the second game is also Harry Potter. It also has a cat on it, so it's really heavy right now. He's, he's chewing on my hand, and he's not exactly a light cat. But, all right, buddy, the box is all yours. The second game is the Harry Potter game. It's Magical Beast Board Game. Um, and this is ages 8 plus. Two to four players, you race around Hogwarts to find missing beasts. And this game features a new swinging leaf feature that allows players to move between two separate board games in the course of play. So we're actually going to open this up because they show you that on the back. I'm not sure the lighting here tonight is actually going to be that helpful. Um, but let me show you exactly what they're talking about. So most board games, we know we unfold and we play the game. It looks like this one actually has something else to it. So it's not just, you know, the typical board game. Um, let's get all this plastic off here and get it over here so the cat won't get it. And he is currently creeping out of the box staring at me because he is a little weirdo. Uh, both of the cats are. I don't know where Benny is. So, let me get this one open. This is actually pretty cool. So if you're a Harry Potter fan, these are definitely going to be on your list of things that you're going to want for the holidays. But we have the Harry Potter game. Ooh, it looks like the instructions are falling out. Here is one of the boards, and we actually have the other board. So here is Hogwarts, and you can move around, and you go through the courtyard, and there's muggle studies and care for magical creatures, divination, all of that stuff we're used to, and Jack's on his way back out. And then you can actually go all the way back to the grounds around Hogwarts. So you can go to Whomping Willow, the Quidditch Patch, oh, Whomping Willow's over here, that's Hagrid's, the Paddock, Forbidden Forest. There's a lot of different things here. Um, and your characters, looks like we have a bunch of different cards here. And the different cards will be different indications. You have your different pieces that you run through the board with. And Jack is really helpful today. And then we have a dice that's actually pretty pretty cool and glittery. I'm not sure if you can see it or not. Um, it's just a regular six-sided die, but it's got Harry Potter style numbers on it and it's black and glittery. So this one, again, is for a little bit older for two to four players, eight plus. And, honey, get out of the camera. And <laughs> this is going to um, be, there's going to be a link for this down below as well. So, 
Again, if you're a Harry Potter fan, these are going to be great games for your next game night or a gift for somebody you know that's a Harry Potter fan. Um, we will make sure that there are links for everything below. And pretty soon here we're going to be having, um, we're doing our videos still Monday, Wednesday, Friday, but pretty soon we're going to start doing larger bulk giveaways. Or, oh, actually there is one more thing in this box. So we're going to do um, bulk unboxings because the holidays are coming and we're going to have a lot more gift ideas for everybody. So at the very bottom of the box that Jack was laying on, um, there is another game called Stuff Happens. Previously we had unboxed Shit Happens. Um, this one, it looks like it's for ages 13 and up instead of 18 and up. So this one um, is pretty much about all the crap that we kind of deal with in our day-to-day -day life. And it looks like it's a kind of game where you combine the cards and you come up with the worst scenario that could be happening to you. And for two or more players, ages 13 and up, you can take this on a trip, you can take this to your family party. This one doesn't have cursing like the other one does, and it probably doesn't have as bad situations. So again, links for this will be below. And we will be posting a new video on Monday, Wednesday, and Fridays. Again, we're getting a little closer. Uh, apparently we have a storm coming, so my lighting's gonna get even worse. Um, we're getting closer to the holiday season, so we're gonna start posting more often and with more group um, unboxings. So subscribe, like this video, and we will have a giveaway coming next Friday. I believe it is, hopefully if the product's coming on time. So make sure you tune in and you like us now, and then next week we will have a giveaway for some pretty cool stuff. So I will see you guys later. Bye.